Now that we added the page, what I want to show you is a very short, short tutorial on how to actually manage content on the site. So let's take a look at the home page. So here you can see that, remember we have this page published, so let's look at, look at the settings here for this node. So we go down here to the publishing options. You see this is published, promoted to the front page, and it's sticky at the top of lists. So let's save it. And the next thing that we're going to do is let's just add one other page. And so since we're adding a blog, we're going to create a article. And let's call this the and so this is going to be a news article on articles we have tags and we'll talk more about tags but basically this is the metadata that will describe this article to our users so in what we'll do is just type in Drupal 7 introduction tutorial managing so and now I'm just going to say this let's create a two views a teaser view and a summary so And so, say this for time's sake, this content will be added later. And so we already added a page, so I'm just going to skip down here. And since this is an article, I'm not going to make a menu link, but I am going to publish this and I'm going to promote this to the front page and publish it and we'll save it. All right, so. You'll see we have the tags listed here. Now we have comments. So people can comment on this because it's a news article. It automatically gets um, comments. We can turn the comments off, but this automatically got comments, which we'll cover in a future tutorial. Now let's take a look at the home page. Well, if this is a blog, we may not want to have the about page to be listed at the very top. Wouldn't we want to have the um, about page to be the about page and the article to actually be displayed in the center um, on the home page for as being a news article. So let's make this happen. Now we don't have to go, since there's a couple actions that need to be take place, we don't actually have to go back into the node edit screen. What we can do here is just go to the shortcut for find content you can also go click on the content link here. They can actually go to the same place. And what we're going to do here is let's just make a couple setting changes. So we have an about page that's stickied, it's published, and it's on the front page. So the first thing let's do is let's go and you can see there's some settings like publish and unpublish and promote it to the front page, demote it. So let's, in this case, let's demote it. We can click update and now the about page has been updated. Now if we go back to the home page, we'll see that the, it's gone and now we have about. We don't have it there. Now let's also go and remove the stickiness from about. So we'll go back to find content and we'll go to about and we'll make make this selected content not sticky and so we update that again and we'll close this down and now we have on the home page we have the introducing Drupal website we have the about page 
but neither one of these bits of content are actually finished. So since I'm not ready to actually have these displayed to my users, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go back to find content and I'm going to choose the select all right here and then I'm going to choose unpublished content and I'm going to unpublish both of these pages. So now they're updated and I'm going to close this and what you can see is that our about menu is gone and so is the page on the front. The article about introducing the Drupal tutorial series. So basically either through the content link or the find content link we can control what's visible and on the site on many nodes at the same time so it gives you an opportunity to be able to um, make it easier to manage your website so that concludes the tutorial on the basics of managing content on the Drupal site <laughs>